Wait a minute, please. As the bookworm, it is my job to ask you to please sign the guest book. If this is your first visit to the backyard and you are not a cat, please type your name on the keyboard. Frankie, you know, is not fond of cats. If you've played here before, click on your name in the guest book. If you do not see your name, use the arrows to scroll up and down the list. Click on Frankie's paw print when you're done. Hurry up now, please. Frankie is waiting for you and I must get back to my books. How to make a mess in your own backyard. Starring me, Frankie. World famous board certified bone barrier. Glad to meet you. Want to lend me a paw? Since we're going to be friends, you can help me bury all these bones. Digging holes, that's my department. You're in charge of burying the bones. This hole holds 10 bones, no more, no less. So let's bury 10 bones in this hole. That's six bones in the hole. That makes 10 luscious bones. I knew I could count on you. Why stop there? Messing up your own backyard is awesome. <laughs> Onward and downward. Let's see. I know. Let's bury eight since that would be great. Eight bones in this hole. That's five bones. Quite a handful. Now that makes eight great bones in the hole. Exactly the right amount. Bone voyage. <laughs> Boy, is my tongue sweaty. Whew. But who cares? There are more bones to bury. Okay, the number nine is especially fine. So I say, in this hole, we bury nine bones. That's two bones in the hole. Those two piles add up to nine fine bones. The perfect number. A bone treasure definitely worth burying. What do you say we go find a puddle to drink? You're not going anywhere, mammal. Who said that? Who's there? Whoa! Wow! 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 It is I, the Queen Bee. Frankie, you are not going anywhere until you have cleaned up the mess you have made in our kingdom. Your kingdom? This is my backyard, isn't it? This, Frankie, is our backyard. Yours, mine, and all the rest of the creatures who live here. Just look at the mess you've made. Pretty good, huh? I'm afraid the time has come to teach you a lesson. By the power invested in me as the queen of the bees, I declare you small. Hey, wait a second! You can't... Whoa! I'm shrinking! I'm shrinking! I'm shrunk. If you wish to become big again, you must become friends with the creatures of this kingdom. Make friends, Frankie! Make friends! Help me! Help me! Whoa! I never knew my backyard was so enormous! It'll take me all day to walk from one end to the other. 
but I hope it doesn't come to that, because all I have to do is make friends and I'll be big again. That's what the Queen Bee said. How to Make Friends, this is starring Frankie, world-famous, board-certified, scaredy cat. How do I get out of here? Maybe the hole in that tree back there leads somewhere safe. Yikes! Another bee! Duck! Call me a busybody. Tell me to mind my own beeswax. But Frankie, I just had to meet you. Who, who, who are you? Are you a queen bee too? Don't be silly. There's only one queen bee and that's not me. I'm Ruby, the worker bee. Can you please take me to the queen right away? I can't handle being small. I can't do that, Frankie. There was a royal proclamation issued by the Queen Bee herself. You've been ordered to climb your way up to the royal beehive. You expect me to climb that tree? Oh, brother, I'm doomed. There's no reason to be scared, Frankie. Just collect the bones you buried in the backyard and use them to climb your way up. Every time you earn five bones, you get to climb a little bit further up the tree and win a magic dog tag. So, get busy! Wow! I mean, bow wow! I've never seen a magic dog tag, and all I have to do is make friends and win back my bones. All right, now what? Maybe that path goes somewhere. Off we go in search of bones. Flowers as big as houses, grass the size of trees. Oh, what a predicament. Just remember what Ruby said. There's no reason to be scared. There's no reason to be scared. Boo! Ah, a snake, a snake! Eh, calm down already. I may act like a snake, but I'm really a worm. And you? I take it you're a chicken. I'm not a chicken. I'm Frankie, world-famous board-certified number one digger in the backyard. Not anymore, Frankie. Now that you're so small, I am the number one digger in the backyard. Not for long, Worm. The Queen Bee promised to make me big again. All I have to do is make friends. Not if I can help it. You can count on that, Frankie. Uh-oh. Well, wasn't I supposed to make friends down here? Don't worry, Frankie. You got friends in high places. You got me, Ruby. Before you know it, you'll have more friends than you can count. Why don't you start at the ant colony? All your digging made quite a mess over there. There are plenty of places to make friends around here. This place is crawling with bugs. Run for your life, little feller. There's a giant buffalo on the loose. He goes by the name of Frankie, and whenever he roams through these parts, the ants get all mixed up. You mean I scare away all the ants? It's not your fault, little feller. It's the giant buffaloes. But if you reckon you can help me sort out all the mixed up ants, I'd be much obliged. Come on, little doggy. Let's you and I wrangle up some ants. It's dark down there, but we're going in. Look out below! What's wrong with those ants? They look more discombobulated than a cactus at the North Pole. You're telling me? It's bedtime for these here worker ants, little doggy. My job is to wrestle them down, rustle them up, and cart them off to bed. Looks like you could use some help, Wrangler Ant. I'd be mighty appreciative if you could match the ants at the top with the ants already in bed down below. Open and shut the doors on the way down to show them where to go. Now 
shut your eyes and go to sleep. Now shut your eyes and go to sleep. Just go to sleep now, you hear? Good night, Lance. Those ants are crankier than a coyote in a thunderstorm. Let's put them to bed pronto. We did it. He's ready for sleep. You're in the right bedroom, little ant. Go to sleep now. Just go to sleep now, you hear? Nighty night, ants. One more batch of ants and we're through. Now shut your eyes and go to sleep. Now shut your eyes and go to sleep. You stay in there now, you hear? Sweet dreams, little ants. Here's a T-bone for you, little dog. 
Happy trails! It's Cowboy Frankie. Yeehaw! Little Doggy's here to help put the ants to bed. Hello? Hello? I can't believe I'm lost in my own backyard. Where's Ruby when we need her? I'm right here, Frankie. I just got back from the garden hose, and the fleas there are just itching for your help. But if you're looking for some high-flying fun, try the dragonflies. They're about to start a game of dragonfly tag. And guess what, Frankie? You're it! Look at that. It's a flea. And it's no bigger than I am. Boy, have I sunk down low on the food chain. Frankie, how could you do this to us, Frankie? When you were big, you were the best friend a flea could have. How do you think we traveled around the backyard? We depended on you, Frankie. You! I know. I remember. Makes me itch just thinking about it. Now the fleas are forced to ride around on Captain Hop's leaf boat. Have you ever seen a bunch of seasick fleas? Believe me, it's not pretty. That's why I volunteered you to help steer the boat. Well, you can count on me, ship ahoy. I bet you're itching to set sail. Follow me. Hey, wait up, flea. I can't jump as well as you can. <laughs> First mate Frankie reporting for duty, sir. Grasshopper's the name, but you can call me Captain Hop. Excuse the mess, but I'm up to my wings with fleas and cargo. And this old river, he stops for no one. Aye, aye, Captain. To balance the boat, the number on the cargo has to match the number of fleas. Or, blub, 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 shoe capsize. I'll shout out the number of fleas. You release them onto the boat. After all the fleas are on board, load the cargo. Ready when you are, Captain. Now boarding. Five. The fleas, Frankie. Load the fleas. Plus four. Click on the fleas to release the second load. Equals. Hoist my cargo onto the riverboat, matey. Nine. That's right. Now we're off. Awesome! Captain Hop is counting on us to steer this baby down the river. Move the mouse to the left and right. Look out for obstacles, and whatever you do, don't run ashore. Good maneuvering! that matches the equation. Here goes nothing. <laughs> Smooth sailing. Flees to port side on the double. All aboard. We're about to set sail. Flees on board, please. Three. All flees on board. 
Plus one. Release the next load. Equals. Heave my cargo onto the leaf, Frankie. Four. Let's go. You did it. It's up to us to steer the ship to safety. That matches your equation. Here goes nothing. <laughs> Smooth sailing. Flees to port side on the double. All set for boarding, Captain. Flees on board, please. Three. All flees on board. Plus five. Release the next load. <laughs> Equals. Now load my cargo, matey. A perfectly balanced load. Now off we go. Hold on tight. Look out for rocks. Good maneuvering. That matches your equation. Here goes nothing. <laughs> Smooth sailing. Flees to port side on the double. Ready when you are, Captain. Flees to port side. Three. Click on the fleas to release the first load. Plus. Zero. Release the next load. Equals. Now load my cargo, matey. Three. A perfectly balanced load. Now off we go. It's up to us to steer the ship to safety. Tunnel matches the equation. That's the one we want. Here goes nothing. <laughs> to Frankie, my first mate, who was a mutt. True heroes deserve a bone. Land ho, Frankie. Thanks. All set for boarding, Captain. Now boarding. Flight path to 
ground control. I just landed in Vector 246. Am I cleared for takeoff? Over. It's a dragon flyer. Try damselfly. The name's Zzz, Amelia. I'm a tactical fighter pilot involved in a game of dragonfly tag. And I need a co-pilot. You have any flying experience? I jumped off the couch once. Roger Wilco, hop on. Zzz. We're off to play a round of dragonfly tag. And we're it. Hey, wait up. I can't fly. My arms are too short. Zoom, zoom. I never flew on the back of a dragonfly before. I feel light as a feather. <laughs> Easy for you to say. I'm the one carrying you. I used to be even heavier before I met the queen bee, that is. She put me on a diet, big time. Play your cards right, co-pilot, and you'll earn enough bones to become big again. All we have to do is tag dragonflies with the mouse. Ground control will send us a signal telling us which dragonflies we should target. Ground control is signaling us with addition problems. Just look for the equation on the ground and click on the dragonfly carrying the number that completes the equation. Ground control has cleared us, Frankie. Let's tag dragonflies. Next. Three. Plus. What? Equals. Six. Going. We're flying high now. Next. Two. Plus. What? Equals. Four. Two. Nice going. We're flying high now. Who's next? What? Plus. One. Equals four. Three. We're aerial heroes. Next up, one plus what equals seven. Who's next? What? Plus four equals eight. Four. We're aerial heroes. We're looking for two plus. What equals five? Three. Nice going. We're flying high now. Next up, what plus one equals three? Aerial Heroes! Next! One! Plus! What? Equals... Eight! Seven! We're the best dog fighters around! Who's next? What? Plus! Equals seven. Flying aces. Next, what? Plus one. Equals four. Top Guns! 
Dorothy and Darren do, I present you, Frankie, with an aviator's bone. You've earned it. Frankie to ground control. All systems are go. Let's play.